the plough, or the great bear, or to give it its full Latin name, Ursa Major. If you look toward the northern sky, you will be able to discern, even through city lights, seven relatively bright stars, which to me look like a large question mark. But the ancients, when they linked them together, it reminded them of a plough. Not only is this one of the largest and most famous of the constellations, it's also an extremely useful constellation because it helps us locate other areas in the sky. For instance, if you line up the two furthest stars on the right and in your mind link them by a line, continue the line up till you hit another bright star. Now this bright star is part of another constellation called Ursa Minor or the Little Bear. Now this constellation is difficult to see, it's not particularly important, but the star that you hit is because this is the North Star. And the North Star is the star which is always in the same place every night, any time of the night. Because the Earth's axis is pointed towards the North Star and as the Earth rotates around, all the stars seem to move around the North Star. So this is our anchor point in the sky. We can also find other constellations. For instance, as the diagram shows, if we link the two diagonal stars and draw that line, we will hit two relatively bright stars and these are part of the constellation Gemini. Again, if we link the two stars as shown in the diagram down with an imaginary line, you will see another group of bright stars and this is called Leo. Mm -hmm.